I remember Andreas rocking up to Kona way back in 2016 on a prototype Cubarium C68. And there was just nothing like that bike at the time. Now, some seven years on, you can still see that initial blueprint from that Cubarium C68 in this bike, which is testament to the work and the testing they did way back then at the time. What has changed a lot is their fluid and storage integration, because brands are starting to realize that it's all very well designing a nice looking and aerodynamic bike. But once you hand it over to the athlete, they're then having to add numerous bottles and bento boxes and other fluid and storage options onto the bike, which may well outdo many of the aero gains that they found in the wind tunnel. So the bike needs to be race ready off the shelf. Those fluid and storage options need to be integrated and designed into the frame from the outset. And that is what Cube have aimed to achieve with their new Cubarium C68X.